Hey guys, welcome back to Six Foot Sports. I am TJ, and as you can see from behind me, I am back at the Westchester Center Fieldhouse as the Westchester Knicks are going to take on the Toronto Raptors D League team. Now, the Westchester Knicks faced a hard loss last week. Hopefully, they can come back and take the win on their home court since they do have home court advantage. Stay tuned as I'll be covering the whole game. Indoor, tough loss today. What were some key things going into the game that you needed to focus on? Uh, you just trying to uh, stop the um, transition. Um, it's a team that really execute well and trying to get out and run. And uh, we didn't just didn't do a great job trying to stop them. Um, so we just uh, got to regroup and just trying to figure out some things. But defensively, we really didn't bring it today. So big game tomorrow. You guys have to come back, possibly grab a win. What are some key things going into tomorrow's game? Uh, well, as of as of now, I don't know yet. I, haven't, uh, I still got to figure out what coach uh, needs us to do because um, I'm fairly with them. So, uh, but you know, as any team you go and play, you just gotta, you know, make sure that you focus um, and just trying to take things away from the teams. And uh, I think tomorrow, that's since we didn't do a great job today. I think tomorrow we're gonna come and bring a lot of energy and just trying to stop guys and trying to take st stuff away from them. Energy is important. You finished the game with 22 points. It seemed like your energy level was on point today, but you had three rebounds. Is that something that you're going to focus on going into tomorrow's game? Yeah, definitely. There's no way I'm, you know, I'm just getting three rebounds as a six-nine big man. But uh, yeah, I definitely got to focus on that tomorrow and try to make sure I get a uh, get a lot of offensive rebounds and defensive rebounds. So. Yeah. Well, I think you got that. Another thing is you played overseas as well as in the NBA as well as, as, well as in the D League. How would you comp compare all three leagues? That's a tough question. Um, definitely the NBA is uh, way different than overseas and playing in the D League. I think there's, uh, there's more intensity in the NBA. The guys are faster. Guys play on Drake lines. Um, you know, as compared to Europe, guys are more relaxed. There's not a lot of physicality into the game. Um, as you can see, European players, when they come here, they kind of struggle the first year. So, um, but the D-League, um, I think there's a lot of competition in the D-League because, you know, guys trying to get picked up and, you know, trying to get on a roster. So you come here, guys are competing night in, night out. The, you know, the intensity level and the game speed might not be the same as the NBA, but still you, you get a lot out of it. Well, thank you, Indoor. Have a great game tomorrow. Thank you. I appreciate it. Jalen, tough loss. What were some key things that coach said in, at halftime in the locker room? Um, basically, we just had to, you know, play better defense. You know, they got a couple easy opportunities. You know, if it's offensive rebound that they were able to score, and we gave a lot of points off in the off the transition. So, big game tomorrow. How are you guys going into that game mentally, and how are you guys going to get prepared? Um, just, you know, paying, to, paying attention to what our coaches say, if it's offensively or defensively, you know, just buying into the team concept and playing well together. So we're well into, you know, the season. This is your first year in the D-League. How are you getting adjusted? Um, I feel like I'm doing, you know, well. You know, my teammates, you know, they encourage me every day, you know, just to be the best person I can and best player I can. So with the help of my teammates, I feel like I'm doing well. Thank you, Jalen. Have a good one. Thank you. You too. Hey, guys, welcome back to Six Foot Sports. Tough loss for the Westchester Knicks as they fell to the Toronto Raptors, 111-99. to Hopefully they can grab a victory here at the Westchester County Center tomorrow when they face off against the Windy City Bulls. Stay tuned. And remember to comment, rate, and subscribe.